question 1. Using the number line, write the integer which is. So, first one is 3 more than 5. So, first we will grab, this is your number line. This is positive side, this is your 0 and this is your negative side. So, more than 5. So, where is your 5? This is your 5 and we have to add 3 more to it. That is plus 3. So, this is your 5. 1, 2, 3. So, you reach to 8. So, this is what you get when you add 3 more to 5. B part, 5 more than negative 5. So, we will take after then part. So, we are at minus 5 right now on the number line and we will go 5 more that is plus 5 1 2 3 4 5 so we come to 0 therefore answer is 0 now C part 6 less than 2 so we will grab 2 this is your 2 and we will go 6 less to it That is towards negative. D part, 3 less than minus 2. So this is your minus 2 and we will go 3 less to it. That is towards left hand side. So 1, 2, 3. So again we are at minus 5. So this is your answer. That was your question number first. Second. Use number line. Again, we have to use number line and add the following integers. So, A is 9 plus minus 6. So, initial position is 9. You will mark an arrow and you have to go minus 6. That is, words left hand side because minus is written. Therefore, we will go 6 position towards left. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, you reach 3. Therefore, answer is 3. B part. 5 plus minus 11 so initial position is at 5 you are at 5 mark it and go 11 position towards left 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so you reach minus 6 that's why minus 6 minus 1 plus minus 7 initial position is at minus 1 and you will count 7 towards your left so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So you reach at minus 8. Now D part minus 5 and 10. Initial position is at minus 5. So here is your minus 5. And we'll count 10. That is plus 10 towards right hand side of the number line. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So you reach at 5. Therefore, answer is 5. E part, minus 1. Then, is, here is your minus 1. You will locate this position of minus 1. Then, we will go minus 2. That is towards left hand side, 2 points. This is your 2 points. That is, we reach now at minus 3. Hold your location. Then again, minus 3 towards left hand side. 1, 2, 3. So finally or eventually you reach at minus 6. Now F part, minus 2. Initial position is at minus 2. This is your minus 2. Then plus 8 towards right hand side because it is plus. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. You are at 6. Now what you'll do is minus 4. That is move to 4 position. That is 1, 2, 3, 4. So you reach at Two. So this is how you do question number second. Third, add without using the number line. Now we don't have to use number line. So A part is 11 plus minus 7. So you can see here it is just a simple subtraction problem. That is you have to subtract 11 from minus 7. So subtracting it you get 4. So this is your answer. Now we will do in some other way. That is by splitting. This is minus 10 and this is we have to add plus 19 to it. So first of all, let's 
right minus 10 as it is and we will see the bigger number in this case now we will split the bigger number in terms of smaller number that is minus 10 so how we can split 19 so first of all we will write minus 10 as it is now plus 19 can be split as 10 plus 9 so what happens is now minus 10 plus 10 gets cancelled out it is similar just you move 10 places from this position and you're coming back to it that is you totally move nothing zero therefore how this comes out now plus 9 as it is so this is your answer now e part now minus 380 plus minus 270 so here again we don't have to use this thing why because here the signs are similar and we have learned in this chapter that when the signs are similar we just add it and put the sign so here 380 minus 270 is nothing when you add it it turns out to be 650 so how you can add it as 0 is 0 and 7 8 gives you 15 1 carry so 3 plus 3 gives you 6 therefore minus 650 is your answer for e part now b part minus 13 plus 18 so here we can see that signs are different we will use our splitting trick or splitting method so what we can do is we will write minus 13 as it is because 18 is bigger we will try to split it in terms of smaller numbers so 18 is so now 13 and minus 13 gets cancelled out so it is 0 and plus 5 as it is therefore 5 is your answer now d part negative 250 add 150 to it now we will see their signs are different and we will see the bigger number we will try to split in terms of 150 so it is very simple 250 can be written as minus 150 and minus 100 that is this number will give you 250 when you add them now plus 150 as it is now we will arrange it because our sole purpose was for deduction only so minus 150 we will get this 150 towards left hand side and minus 100 towards left hand side so this cancels out and minus 100 as it is therefore answer is minus 100 for d part f part minus 217 we have to add negative 100 to it now again we don't have to use the earlier method because signs are same and we have learned when signs are same we just add the numbers and put the sign so it is very simple 217 plus 100 is what it is 317 this can be done in mind so this was your question number third question fourth find the sum of so we have to find the sum that is addition so a part is 137 and minus 354 so we will try to add it y plus sign because sum means addition bear in mind sum means addition now 137 plus just we use brackets so that we don't get confused the sole purpose of using brackets is only this so 137 and we will see signs are different so we will split 354 in terms of 137 and when we subtract it we come to know that 137 and 217 makes 354 now it becomes easier to subtract because it is 0 and 217 comes as it is and keeping its sign sign was negative so answer is minus 217 now b part it is very simple minus 52 plus 52 it is just similar that you went 52 steps ahead and then you came back 52 so your total movement was zero therefore answer is zero now c part minus 312 now we don't use brackets because plus is not that much complicated so we use plus 39 straight away plus 192 now minus 312 as it is and we combine when the signs are same we just combine them so 192 plus 39 is 231 you can do it in this way 9 plus 2 adding one digit gives you 11 1 carry 9 plus 1 is 10 plus 3 is 13 and plus 1 is 2 so therefore it is 231 and now we will see the bigger number 312 is bigger we will try to split it in terms of 231 so when you split it it is 231 and 81 gives you 312 so we have split it now we arrange them minus 231 plus 231 arranged minus 81 towards right hand side now this gives 0 minus 81 as it is so this is your c part now d 
minus 50 now we will use plus and again for complication avoiding complication we will put in brackets so you can see signs are same so we will add them put in the sign of negative so it is easy 200 plus 50 gives you 250 plus 300 as it is minus 250 as it is now here it is simple we will look the bigger number and we will split it in terms of 250 so 300 can be split it as 250 plus 50 so we have split it and now we will it is already arranged now 250 and minus 250 gives you 0 50 as it is so therefore 50 is your answer and that was your question number four question five find the sum we have a part minus 7 plus minus 9 plus 4 plus 16 we will analyze here that these signs are same we will not do like we did in previous questions here we will do straight away so signs are same we will add it it gives you minus 16 and here signs are plus so we will add them 16 plus 4 gives you 20 therefore we have written plus 20 and it is very easy minus 16 plus 20 is nothing but 4 and sign comes of bigger number when the signs are different you just subtract them you put the sign of bigger number therefore plus 4 and we don't write plus because it is not necessary to write plus so this is your a part now b part we will analyze here again look we have three negative numbers so we will add them so how we will add them 8 plus 2 gives you 10 it is very easy to add 8 plus 2 gives you 10 and 10 plus 65 gives you how much it is 75 therefore 37 as it is and adding all the negative numbers and putting negative sign before them and adding them gives you 75 so now here again the signs are different 37 is positive 75 is negative we subtract them and that gives you 48 and the sign comes of higher number higher number was negative therefore sign came of negative that is negative 48 so that was your b part and that was your last question question number five